Hi, this is Peter Clayton. We are at MREC in Atlanta, Georgia at the uh, Georgia Tech Conference Center, which is a really great facility. And I'm uh, joined today by Pablo Fluentes, who is the uh, founder and CEO of a site called Proven.com. So Pablo, thank you for joining me. Yeah, thank you, Peter. really appreciate you having me. All right, so you go to uh, Proven.com and there's something there about Craigslist and mobile and Tell us what you're doing. Yeah, so really, really, we're a mobile first company. So the the main way to find our products is through the app stores, uh, both the uh, the Apple App Store and the Google Play Store. And what we have is uh, native apps that allow people to apply to jobs from their mobile devices and access. They can access Craigslist, and then they can also access Simply Hired and Beyond. And uh, what's great about our product is that it allows people to store their resumes and cover letters, different versions of the resumes and cover letters. We also have a free resume creation tool. And what's great is that they can apply to jobs on the go uh, from anywhere. And uh, our users find that really, really useful uh, because a lot of them use their mobile device as the main way to access the internet. Uh, and they uh, don't really have a computer that they, uh, they're using. And, um, it, it for, for purposes of applying to jobs. So they have a 15 minute smoke break or uh, they're maybe running around if they're a healthcare, uh, healthcare worker and for them it's very convenient to use the apps to, to do that. So most of uh, the people who are uh, interacting with your site and are, are using this uh, to apply for jobs are applying for hourly jobs, is that correct? Uh, there are some people who apply for hourly jobs. There are also some folks that, uh, so the biggest uh, four verticals for us are uh, service and hospitality, food mm -hmm. service and hospitality, and then uh, also healthcare, and then you also have folks that apply to sales and administrative jobs. So for people who are applying to uh, administrative and clerical jobs and sales jobs, those may or may not be hourly uh, jobs. But uh, I would say in general, the biggest uh, defining characteristic of our users is, is that a lot, most of them are not on LinkedIn and they look for jobs on Craigslist. And they, uh, most of them use their uh, mobile device as their main way to connect to the internet. So if you have a gateway to Simply Hired and Beyond.com, which are both uh, job aggregators, as most of you know, uh, you're, uh, you know, you're being able to serve up virtually, I would say, 80% of the display ads that exist out there. Right, and, and also we have Craigslist, which is a big advantage because a lot of folks uh, you know, cannot access those jobs. And Craigslist has essentially taken the place of newspaper classifieds in the United States. Um, so yeah, we, we, the, our users have access to a tremendous uh, breadth of jobs. You know, wh one of the things that um, I've been talking about for, for many years is the resume black hole. You know, you, you apply for a job, you know, through, a, through a, a link on Simply Hired, which will take you to the career portal of the, the company that has that ad, and you jump through the hoops of their applicant tracking system, and you never hear yep. anything from anybody ever. So is the mobile experience changing that and, and the things that, that you're doing uh, with Proven, um, what are the, uh, you know, the response rates that you're getting versus what you would get you know, using a, a laptop going on to a career site? Sure. So a, a big thing for, for Craigslist jobs is uh, that it, it, the response time matters quite a bit. So the half-life of a Craigslist post is you know, somewhere in like a day and a half range. So after um, you get most of the responses you know, front-loaded. So having people apply to those jobs as soon as the job becomes available is a big deal, and which is something where mobile can have a big impact. And those people can have, uh, you know, we did measure that they had a, a higher chance of getting a callback if, they, if that happens. Unfortunately, they, I mean, they, there still is uh, the problem that a lot of employers sometimes don't respond, especially for positions where there's higher volume mm -hmm. of applicants. Um, but we do, because most jobs on Craigslist are applied uh, to through an email address, there's a lot more, I mean, it's a lot easier for people to reach uh, that employer and make sure the resume gets read as opposed to, yeah, a lot of times, unfortunately, uh, in, in larger companies that use applicant tracking systems, things get lost because uh, people use maybe uh, different filters and different uh, ways to uh, narrow down the candidate funnel that may or may not reflect the quality of those candidates, but that's just you know the nature of the beast with those companies. So, um, how do you make money uh, with uh, Proven? So we currently are making uh, some money from from affiliate traffic from from folks that, that look at jobs, um, but really the monetization is not our current focus. Uh, we're really focused. We're growing our community. 
Uh, we, we have over 150,000 monthly active users, and it's really exciting, and we've been growing, and we're still, we're still uh, you know, in the early stages, but we're growing, and it's really exciting for us to be there. And uh, our, our, the long-term goal is really to grow a community of engaged people that are using their smartphone to apply to jobs. Mm -hmm. um, and we have great investors that support that vision and understand that, and that's, uh, that's, that's really a long-term goal. Yeah, and uh, as anybody would attest that's attended this conference, I mean, the, the adoption rate of mobile is, you know, and tablets is just, it's through the roof. Yeah. And, and companies who are, not, who are not engaging with applicants uh, over a mobile device are really losing out a tremendous amount of qualified candidates. Yeah, and, the, and there's also this misconception in the marketplace that uh, folks that maybe have hourly jobs don't have smartphones. And that's, that's just simply not accurate. Uh, a lot of the, uh, you know, especially people, who, it is seen as a status symbol, you know, for, for people. And it's also, the, you know, it replaces the role of a telephone and of an internet bill. And that's the main way in which people access the internet. And that's a really important tool in people's lives. Um, so even though, uh, you know, smartphone penetration is somewhere in the, you know, 50, 55% range right now, I would say it has a lot more to do with, uh, with age demographics in terms of the breakdown than it does in, in terms of uh, socioeconomic income, uh, socioeconomic brackets, rather. So it, it's for us, it's really exciting to build tools for a segment of society that's never really had tools built for them to find jobs. And that's, that's where we differentiate ourselves, and we're, uh, we're really excited to, to take the lead on that. Yeah, and I think people need to realize these, these people do have smartphones. Yeah. They may not have a PC, but right. they have a smartphone. Absolutely. They may have a, maybe one shared PC at home that's five years old, ten years old, and that uh, they're not nearly as proficient on that, on that PC as they are in their smartphones. They, the standards for user experience have become so high on smartphones, and people have become very used to using a lot of these interfaces. Um, so, so that they're much, really much better at using their, their phones than they are their, their desktop computers, if they have one. Yeah, one of the uh, uh, speakers here yesterday uh, was from uh, UPS. Mm -hmm. And UPS has really done a very good job of building out uh, mobile applications because their drivers, uh, you know, the people that they're trying to hire, yep. they're the ones that have the smartphone devices who perhaps don't have a, a home PC, yep. and um, that's how they're engaging with these Absolutely. people. That, that, that makes total sense. Uh, I, I'm not familiar with UPS's uh, case per se, but uh, yeah, that, that's exactly the kind of demographic that, that is applying to jobs using Proven, and yeah, they, they do spend a lot of uh, time on their smartphones. Great. Well, thank you so much Great. for taking time to speak with me today Great. here uh, in Atlanta at the uh, Mobile Recruiting Technology Conference. Sounds good. Thank you, Peter. Thank you.